So here we go, Johnny Lamaro, a young man from midfield, a junior with a strong leg, wearing number one, will kick off for Southern Miss. And deep for the Crimson Tide. Marcel West and Calvin Hall. Got a little seam there. That's a good turnout. That we've got that ball a good surge in about the 28-yard line. You saw the speed on that series there of the Southern Mississippi defense. They swarm the football. Hayden Stockton boots it away, gets a good kick. Good kick. Pearson fields it at the 32-yard line and works his way up around the 40. Very big, but very young. And wide open for a first down. And a little extra is the tight end, Terry Hardy from Montgomery, Alabama. They can run him down. He ran back to pass. And again, it's the tight end, Larry Norton. And we should credit Andre Short for a uh, touchdown saving tackle. There wasn't anybody else there. They're back with standard personnel, two backs, two wides, a tight end. They're bringing the back in motion, effort to flood the zone. And they flood it for a first down, and it's going to go for a touchdown. Touchdown, Golden Eagles, Eric Booth. They didn't let the receiver or the wide man go down. So here's Hayden Stockton. Ryan Pearson lets this one go out of bounds. That went off the side of his foot. And they actually turn out with a pretty decent field position up around the 38-yard line. That's where they started their last drive. Yeah, we had a third down. And Fred Brock, first down, Southern Mississippi. Dwayne Rudd brings him down. Brad Ford committed, almost came up with the interception, but it's a big first down for Southern Miss. There's the tight end moving, changing the uh, strength of the formation. Off, off tackle play. Big gainer right up the pike. Eric Booth, the young man who scored the touchdown. This is when we got to rise to the occasion. Here's an option play. Got a hell of a wall off there. Good blocks on, on our inside-out pursuit. First down, Southern Miss. So once again, it's first and 10 from the 29. Shaw looking at the outside, and he does. It's going to go for a first down and more, and he's knocked out of bounds by Deshae Towns and up around the 12-yard line. So Chris Pierce... A young man who is a black belt in Taekwondo Karate, a strong leg, will try to kick this one through. And he does, so there you have it. Southern Miss on top, 10-0, scoring on their first two possessions. And Chris Pierce has to be a relieved and happy young man because a year ago, Alabama blocked everything he tried in Tuscaloosa. Doug, we're in an unbalanced line now with a tight end over. We got, uh, should be a good running formation for us as was just shown right there. It was. Dennis Riddle with a hard run right up the middle, right at Southern Miss. You see the time? Closing in. There's a, a play for Turn it up. Turn it up. Dennis Riddle. First down. That's a good play right there. That's... And now the crowd starting to turn up the volume. Eight-yard gain for Dennis Riddle. All right, we in unbalanced line again. Quick hit it. And it's a fumble. It a Southern Mississippi play recovers. Back and it was a fumble. Uh, Third down and 12 for the Golden Eagle. Uh, Southern's in a diamond, a three wide tight end. Screen play. Big play, big play by the defense. Deshae Townsend was in Fred Brock's face. There it comes. We're going after it. Got pretty good penetration. Cliche calls for the fair catch around the seven or eight yard line. Pierce is also their punter. Second down and seven. All right, we're in our two tight end scheme with Haight, bringing Brown on the corner. There's a Curtis Brown. Throw to Curtis. A curl around inside. Good completion. Big play. He needed to get up around the 30 yard line, about a yard short. So Hayden Stockton boots it away this time. A much better kick than his last one. Pearson, Ryan Pearson, looking for that Got wall. The wall right there. And he gets to the outside, up around the 33-yard line, and a flag on the play. We're in, we're in a position to, we got the return on this time, but we were showing a block. Not a good kick. Oh, Alabama will start right. up around the 34-yard line. Good field position. 
And it's really because of Coach Bryant and John Forney. Uh, they wanted to put a third man down on the field, and they, they had to sell Coach Bryant on it. He wasn't real high on it, but uh, it worked out real good. Uh, Doug, we're showing standard formation now with Hape at the true fullback position, an eye formation. And a good fake, Dennis Little comes out of the pack. What a good move, breaking it to the outside, first down, his biggest gain of 1995, up around the 31-yard line. Again, we're back into eye formation, standard look, Hape is the fullback. A drop back action from it, there's a screen, good looking play. Dennis continues to be the workhorse. Michael Proctor will attempt a 45-yard field goal, and those are the kind of hits that will make Brian Bergdorf a sore young man tomorrow morning. Proctor good hit. Looks good. With ease, he makes it look so, so easy, and Alabama's on the board 10-3, the All-American Michael Proctor. Southern Miss, the third and long situation. Got to get pressure. There it comes right there. And Graham has a lot of room. A good move on Dwayne Rudd, and he goes all the way up to the 40-yard line. Another big haul, and close to a first down is Eric Booth. Golden Eagles on the move. Five and a half minutes to play. There's, There's the, the option. option again. And Booth put his head down. If he stays up, he's going to score, and he does. He's been the star of the game so far, Eric Booth. We need, to, we need to respond this half. We need to put points on the board before we go in. And the ball is fumbled. Fagan will have to bring it out. And he gets stopped around the six-yard line, so the tie back in a hole. They will be in a, an advantage uh, position right here when they take it. Hell of a kick by uh, Stockton. Good height on it. Good coverage. Pearson looking That's for the wall. Should be a flag. They did. They threw the flag, Coach, and Pearson gets brought down, and they'll take that back from the point of the foul. Got, got the block on. He hit it good. Good kick. Good and the kick. fair catch called for around the 23-yard line. Michael Vaughn, the freshman from Clarksdale, Mississippi. Second down and 10. There it is. Wide open. Dennis Riddle out of the backfield gets the first down, which will stop the clock as they move the chains. Obviously, uh, they're just happy with this 17-3 lead. They'll run out the clock. Nice punt. Nice punt. He's going to let it go. Southern is doing the same thing. They don't want a chance fumbling that punt where we could get us, uh, get points out of, the, out of the half right before we go in. Well, uh, these guys really deserve a big hand, and I can remember hearing them a couple of times. Uh, Couple of, uh, couple of blocks down the field there, so good, good job, guys. Lamont, thank you. And we look forward to watching the Million Dollar Band at halftime. Gene Stallings in the Tide. We'll have to talk it over at halftime and come up with a way to stop this Southern Mississippi attack, which has been very, very impressive, Coach, especially those running backs. They're big, they're strong, they run hard, and uh, they've been blowing Alabama off the ball. He hesitated, and the darn thing almost got blocked. As Shay Townsend calls for the fair catch on the 41-yard line. Fernando Bryant for Alabama almost had a career first block. Standard personnel again, eye formation. Tied in wide side. Here comes the blitz from the outside. There it is. There it is. Moderate Malone, the big play man down to the 24-yard line. Wide formation, four, uh, four wide receivers. Bryant pulls it down. Lots of room. First down up around the 12-yard line. Two tight end scheme. Got a fade route. It ought to Curtis be there. Brown. Touchdown. Touchdown, Alabama. All right. Terrific grab Great by throw. Curtis Brown. They've certainly started the second half the way Alabama is supposed to play with a lot of, uh, a lot of enthusiasm, a lot of toughness. Big play right there. All right. And flags down. They'll get him for the face mask, I believe. They're calling it the 15-yard variety. <laughs> Chris Pierce bobbled the last snap. 
We, we're showing punt block, but we're going to return it. Hey, he got it close to it. One man made it. Fernando oh, Ryan Lord has been Apple. close. Deshae Townsend lets it bounce down to the 30-yard line. Good snap. And he hits it. Pearson on the 32. And Southern Miss now has good field position. We're showing a, 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 that we're going to rush the punter, but we also can return from that same alignment. The return is on. We're trying to hold them up, trying to set the wall. Oh, and it's there it is. Picked up and tripped up. Good tackle by Roy Stabler. The tie closing the gap in that department. Barber. There's a play action. Tyler Malone. Hey, Good catch. great catch. Great catch. 32-yard pass play. Good blocking from the line. Another play action fake. Ryan takes off. Stones his feet. Gets his first down. 35-yard line. Two wides. There's the play right up the middle. Ryan Steger. First down. First down play. 12-yard gain, Brian Steger. They're showing possibility uh, uh, man coverage, but they're play, uh, playing underneath man. Got a chance to... Oh, touchdown! touchdown. Curtis oh. Brown on the deflection. Marcel West tipped it right to Curtis Brown. Touchdown, Alabama. And they're an extra point away from being tied up. You expect the special teams to win one or two games a year for you by making a big play. This would be a great time for it. We've got the hold up. The return is on. We're kicking out on their wide man. The shade Towns looks block. for the wall. Oh! And, and a flag we're down. For a clip, but I don't believe it was a clip. Need to get this ball up the field for the first down or up the field so that we uh, we got a better chance when we punt it. We gain field position. There it is. First down to Curtis hey, Brown. Hey, play, big play. All right. Brian Pearson, deep for Southern Mississippi. They're going to try to return it. We've got good height. We ought to get the coverage on this punt. Fair catch at the 35. Look at those rushing yards for Southern Miss in the second half. There yeah. is a high formation. Uh-oh, big gainer for Southern Miss. Ryan Pearson breaks the tackle up around the 43-yard line. We're playing a, a, a pass defense up there. We're not even trying to rush the punter. He's in the end zone, so we get it on the 20. Under eight minutes now in the fourth quarter. We're all tied up. They have a return on. They've got two people on each of our wide outs to dog them. Not a good play. Hey, got a Great good roll bounce. for us right there. Good break, good break. 32-yard line is where Southern Miss will take over. High formation. There it is, off tackle play. And that's Shaw, who we showed you moments ago with ice on his knee, back in the ball game, running hard. Have to be impressed with the way those big fellas run. They are hard. No. First down, Southern Miss. And he finally gets knocked out of bounds. That's Pearson. Almost intercepted, but Pearson was close to the first down then gets knocked back a gain of eight yards brings up second down and two and shaw gets the first down up here e graham 13 out of 25 128 yards intercept oh. First down to the tight end, Terry Hardy, his first reception since the opening drive of the football game. Uh, they're in a trips, one back, trip three wise to the uh, wide side of the field. And hey! the blitz from the outside. Ralph Staten 
hammers Heath Graham. This again is a big play. They're going to try to get a, a, a positive yardage to get in range. Do kick it one. There's the quick throw. Oh, the deflected pass goes to Ryan Pearson down to the 18-yard line. Ralph Staten is on the left side. Dwayne Warrod on the right side. They'll become charging hard. Daryl Blackburn will jump up in the middle. Looks like he's coming up the middle. And it's good. He hit it. Chris Pierce has put Southern Mississippi on top with 2.50 remaining. 2017. Curtis Brown now comes low with Chad Goss. Completing the four wide receiver set. Third down. The blitz comes from the outside. Brian gets sacked. Number 93 is Tim Bell. Dennis Riddles in the backfield. And Tyler Moreau gets the first down. First down, big play, big play. Up to the 31. Man, was that a big play. Lots of time. Two minutes to go. And the catch to Curtis Brown. Get out of bounds, out of bounds. Curtis. And he does. Okay. Clock stops with a first down. Brian now over 200 yards passing. 15 out of 22. 201 yards. He's showing a little bit of a blitz right here. And there's Todrick back in the ball game. Over the sideline, Todrick up the field, up the field. All right. Up to the 41-yard line. He just needed a player or two to recoup. Proctor's career-long field goal, 53 yards. showing a blitz yards. right here that may be coming. Here comes the blitz. Marcel West. Make a move, Marcel. Paco Kibro All right, we up got to it. the 36. We got to jump up, line up. And the catch. Curtis Brown needs to get out of bounds, and he does. Stops the clock. Four wides again. And it looks like he was looking for the end zone, and he's sacked. And so now time will really tick away. They've got to hurry. Next. Brian has got to get rid of the ball there. He can't lose yardage. That, that puts us in a strain now. Uh, we need to make a big play here. It's fourth down. I got a decision. We got to have a completion, or we got to have a got to go for the end zone with it. There it is. Got it, Malone. Touchdown, touchdown, touchdown Alabama! Alabama. Right. Touchdown, Alabama! Unbelievable! 17 seconds on the clock, and out of nowhere, Bergdorf to Tyrick Malone, and the tide has pulled another one out of the fire. Wow! What a play! What a play! I tell you. Uh, drive through the ball over the outside of shoulder of, of, the, of Malone. The defender got turned around underneath. A great play adjusted to the ball by Malone. The cardiac crimson tie. You have to admit, when it was 4th and 15, things were looking pretty, pretty long. Well, you know, uh, that's the way it happens. I think Auburn made a 4th and 15 against us a couple that's years right. ago. And the interception, Ralph Staten kills right. it. That wins the game. And another come from behind victory for Gene Stallings in the Crimson Tide. And there's the smile from the coach. All right. They pull it out of the fire to beat Southern Mississippi 24-20.